better to be all around you than just in front. So they're prey items. They're not predators. Oh my goodness, I see it. It's, it's a cat. It's a baby cheetah. No, 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 no. Uh, you, uh, what? How long have you been here? I, I don't know. My remember. goodness. Have you not learned that this is not a baby cheetah? But how do you know? It looks like large grasses. Then their babies can see that. So it's kind of like moms, how they always say they have eyes in the back of their uh, heads. They actually do. They do. So it helps the babies find them. But it also oh my goodness! A sheep! A sheep! What is going on? Why is a sheep? A sheep? Who knows what kind of sheep this is though? There's actually many really different kinds of species of sheep. This is a Navajo churro sheep. That was a trick question really, not the hard one. I can't tell my sheep apart. But this is actually a Navajo churro sheep. And he has two horns, right? You saw two horns? Did you know they can have up to six horns? Have you seen six horns on a sheep? They can have six horns. That's really weird looking. But like, go ahead and bring out Sierra. I knew I knew that part. That's one of the things about being back here on the scene. We get to see our old friend. All right. So this is Sierra and her trainer, trainer Mandy. Now who here loves dogs? Don't we all? We all love dogs. Now do these make good pets? Yeah. yeah. Yes, they do. So Sierra here works for a studio company, and she's here at America's Teaching Zoo because we are a school, and she is teaching us how to train her. Because that's what we get to do here on the zoo. This is like you guys go to school, and you guys learn how to do what? What are you guys learning in school? What's your favorite subject? Reading and math. Reading and math to 100 next time. I don't know. So, right. who knows what this is? It is a type of monkey. Good job. This is an olive baboon. So we here at America's Teachers get around work with a wide variety of animals, not just domestic. We get to work with wild too, and it's the same principles that we put to your basic house dog that we do to a wild animal. We just might have to take a little bit more safety precautions, but we do the same training and we get to work with them. So these guys are from Africa. So when we were on our safari, we could have seen them. Unfortunately, we didn't get to run into them in Africa, but we get to here, so that's cool. <laughs> what? He does fight because he's like a teammate. Teenager has a long stage. I want to go see an owl. There's one right near your Come face. On. Okay, then we'll have to go. Come on, you two. I love the mystery. Uh -huh. I like that. I like it too. Uh -huh. I do. I think it's my favorite enclosure. Never forget when Lucy was small, but at San Diego, where you had the full beard and the monkey only wanted to go to you. Walk and see what else is over here. Oh, you're a cell licker. <laughs> <laughs> 